Hey everyone, I'm LC Gamer, and welcome to Mega Man Zero Three. Uh, not exactly sure how to, what's going on since the last game, but I think we're about to find out. The, le the legendary Ripley Zero awoke from a long slumber. The CL's resistance, he defeated Copy X, the ruler of Neo Arcadia. The terror of the Neo Arcadian regime, regime ended, but the energy shortage remained a constant problem. Ciel devoted herself to researching new forms of energy. El Paizo became the newly appointed resistance leader. However, overcome by his desire for power, El Paizo awoken awakened the Dark Elf, whose magic had once nearly destroyed the world. Paizo, thirsting for the power of the Dark Elf, lost sight of his true duty, and was finally defeated after a fierce battle. However, the Dark Elf fled, her dis destination unknown. The battle over the Dark Elf had only just begun. A very Star Wars uh, text scroll. Two months later, after the events of uh, the second game, I love the snow. It sure is quiet. There haven't been many uh, Neo Arcadian attacks lately. Things are almost too peaceful now. Miss Yell completed her research on the new energy. If it solves the energy crisis, the Arcadia won't have a reason to fight us anymore. Actually, I already informed Neo Arcadia about this new energy, the CL system, but I haven't received a reply yet. Don't worry. I'm sure their answer will come soon. There's no more reason to fight. We can live in peace, right? We're in the middle of a mission. So put a lid on it and walk. Sorry. Is that a sword? The reading is getting stronger. We're close. Snow is lining up. Wow. Look at that. It looks like a sword. Is that some kind of ship? Miss Seal. Did that huge thing fall from outer space? Yes, but what's more? It's giving out the same energy reading as the Dark Elf. Of which there is only one in the whole world. Zero was against the idea, but I just had to find out. What could possibly be going on here? The Arcadia has the area ahead of us cordoned off. What? You guys stay here until I make sure it's safe. Okay. Be careful, Zero. And off I run. Alright, now let's change up a few settings, as always. Uh, I'm going to be using the B type for the, some of this, but I'll probably switch over to C as needed. And uh, I think that's everything on here. No. Stop it. Sheesh. I'm trying to scroll and it won't let me. Okay. Weapon switch. Oh, the sword is my main. Yeah. New things to the hack and slash. Okay. So far. Okay. What's this? Disc. Some kind. 
another one. Hey, look. Ah, that's interesting. Now... The head. That's where the Dark Elf reading is coming from. She knew who I was. Why would the Elf, who almost destroyed the world, know me? Here, are you there? Maintain radio silence. The enemy is near. I'm sorry. Get down. Get down! New Arcadians! Ciel, look out! Ah, uh, great. No! This is what happens when you don't follow radio silence orders. Relax, they won't come to any harm. Harpuya? I'm letting you off the hook this time, but you and those resistance fighters must leave now. You're letting us off the hook. Scram. I don't have time to mess with you now. Okay. Zero. Can you hear me? Seems you're okay. Leave the rest of this up to me. I want you all to head back to the resistance base. But zero. What was that? I've heard that voice somewhere before. Is it calling me? Well, if it is, or isn't, I'm gonna have to investigate. I almost got crushed by ice. Yep, that's what happens. Let fall on you. And got it. Alright. Oop. Come on now. Alright, so far so good. Ha. This that. I'm going to everything I want at this level, except for one-ups. That's what I really want right now. Here we go. You're asking for it. I'll blast you to pieces. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. He's a got it. He's a size of a giant. Are you alive, Fefnir? What a monster. Two of us fighting together and not a scratch. Mega, the evil Ripley banished from New Arcadia. It's pretty tough. Zero, what the heck are you doing here? What is that thing? That's Omega. His mere existence defy, defies reality. He's strong, but he's not as fun to fight as you are. <laughs> I don't feel like fighting him, so he's all yours. See you later, Zero. Ah, that Leviathan. I can't move. Well, we'll have to finish this some other time. Hey, Zero. I'll get you and that Omega one of these days. Don't you dare die before then, Zero. Uh, hi. Can we talk? 
Mea, huh? So you are the one who called me here. Oh. And shoot. Okay, they're too close. Nope. Now, I almost got away without taking any damage. That works. Oh dear. He's not staying down. You just don't give up, do you? So you're Omega. I'm afraid I can't let you leave this place ever. Time for your destruction. Omega, that will be quite enough. From this day forward, you will fight with this person as a new Arcadian. It's not polite smashing a friend like that. A new... a new Arcadian? Who is this guy? <laughs> I'm Wile. You may call me Dr. Wile. You must know my name, Harpuya, of the Four Guardians. And you, the legendary hero, Zero. Dr. Wile? You're kidding me. You can't be. Why are you... Who were... You... Who were banished from New Arcadia a century ago with Omega? That simple. I... I brought him. Ma Master X, is that you? Harpuya. <laughs> you haven't ch changed. Then there's... Mist you, Zero. You must be... You're a copy, aren't you? <laughs> I brought back Master X, who you defeated long ago. ago. Ah. Stuck in the X voice now. To protect humanity from the chaos of this world. While saving my life, I owe him <laughs> some. So... I'll take Omega back. Thank you. Harpuya, you keep searching for the Dark Elf. Omega and the Dark Elf. We'll need them both for what's to come. But Master X, think how many humans died. Because of the Dark Elf and Omega, both built by this man, how can you justify exposing humanity to such a grave danger? Especially now, with the energy crisis almost solved. What's this? Are you trying to tell Master X what to do? When did you grow so bold, Harpuya? While you... So, Zero, you guys are also searching for the Dark Elf, right? Let's m make a contest out of this. I'll sh show you who the real hero is. <laughs> now things are getting interesting, Zero. Let's see how far you get with that body. <laughs> Body. 
zero. This is terrible. So you were monitoring the whole thing? Hurry back to base. Operator? Commencing trans. Thank you, Operator. Uh, may not have gotten a perfect score, but oh well. One off. Got a 99 out of 100. And these discs cannot be analyzed. Well, this one can. Got a Cyber Elf Sophie. Sophie. Maya. 100D crystals. Alright. Going back to base. Transferring. Two. One. Transfer complete. Oh boy. This is gonna be a long video. What should I do? Well, for now, not letting New York Kitty have the Dark Elf. For one. That would be priority number one. We'll calculate our best course of action, giving priority to the search for the Dark Elf. I will report to Miss Ciel as soon as the results are in. Miss Ciel, please cheer up. Everything's turned out alright before, hasn't it? That's right. We believe in you, Miss Ciel. And in Mr. Zero, too. Thank you, everyone. The simulation will take a while longer to finish. I think we're going to need your help again, Zero. But you should get a little rest first. For now, we'll save your data. Sure, why not? Saving game. Data saved. Take care of managing the data, just like always. If you need anything, let me know. One more thing. You should go see... Servo. Servo. Curvo? I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm gonna stop trying. I hear he's finished his secret disk analyzer. If you find any secret disks that you can't analyze, ask... Servo... I'm just gonna call him Servo. To have a look for you. Sure, why not? I'm gonna go take a look around the base. Hey, there's a disc. The lull in attacks from New Arcadia had me optimistic that it seems they're on the move. I just hope they don't come here. For my job, the quarter things are the better. Harder things are the better. Yay! My tongue is trying not to work with me today. Or is it just my ability to read? Ah, oh, yes. If you have some time, do visit old Andrew. Let's see. I think he's on the third floor. Okay. Oh. Speaking of old Andrew, I just remembered. This disc belongs to old Andrew. But since he's no good with machines, you just go ahead and take it. Cool. Hello. Servo's room. Go through the commander's room to the right, and it's the room right in front of you. It's convenient that the base is so big now, but it sure is easy to get lost. And you're telling me. Alright. Uh, I might be able to do some renovations to the base with some of those bonus cards from... I've been collecting. Hey, Mr. Zero. Lately, I've been so bored, my trigger finger is itching. I suppose that's nothing to complain about, right? Oh, yes. I can't make out what's on this disc. You can have it. Thank you. Talking to everybody in the base first. Mr. Zero. Before I worked here, I was a security guard in the desert. Of course, that was over a, a, over a, a year ago. Yeah, I remember you. You were in the first game. Do, do, 
Discs, I think I can collect at the moment. Might be a few more. Now, go down to floor four. Hey, hey! How's the new guy doing? Oh, pardon me. Can't keep calling the legendary Roid the new guy. It's been so boring since that El Paso left here. No one complains when I skip work. I don't have any stories to tell. There's just no excitement anymore. You sure? Did you take the disc lying there? Yeah, yeah I did. That disc is pretty much just my pers person personal profile. Yeah. Tongue stopped working again. Wonder what would possess someone to write about me. It was as accurate as could be, but surely there's something more interesting to write about. Yeah. I'm sure there is. Hey there, Zero. Have you heard? The appearance of Omega, who has the same signature as the Dark Elf, has caused a rift in our world. The rift is called Cyberspace. Yay, Cyberspace. The mysterious doorway connects it to the real world. Inside Cyberspace, Cyber Elf abilities auto-activate. Really? Oh, yes, about Cyberspace. Want to know more? Sure. Then let me explain. Some Elves activate when you go into Cyberspace, but not all Elves do. Only Elves with the A mark on them, on the lower left of the icon, activate. They activate even when not grown, and they also don't die. There are also no penalties for using elves. Huh. But when you enter cyberspace, you lose five mission points. Oh. Also, in cyberspace, you get no secret discs from foes, and you can't fight bosses while still inside. Okay, interesting. Thank you for the tip. Third floor, Andrew. What's this? You must be the new whippersnapper. Huh, <laughs> I'm kidding. Even my memory isn't quite that bad. Sure, sure it isn't. By the way, son, where's the young lad with the long blonde hair? Who was in the commander's room until just recently? Oh, him, um... I ended up having to uh, stop him from going mad with power, and ended up severely injuring him, so he's no longer here. Well, there's nothing really. There was just this thing. Hey, Zero, can you have a moment? Can you listen to my story? Can I tell you? Sure. Might as well. A long time ago, I was a teacher at a school. Back then, there were many humans. It is no falsehood to say we lived in harmony together. I have so many good memories of those days. My one, one memory, most vivid, is when we went on a picnic. There was a girl who had forgotten to bring her lunch, and when lunchtime came, she sat alone by herself. All her friends were too busy talking and eating to notice. She heard she had a hard time fitting in. Didn't speak up much. She didn't know how to tell her friends she forgot lunch. When I saw her, I figured that as much had happened. So I gave her some donuts I had made that morning. Oh, Bored already? Nah, keep going, keep going. I, you're not wasting any of my time. You know, before I th taught, I worked at a bread factory. And before that, I was a sailor. Whoops, went off track. I was telling you about me giving my giving the girl a donut. She didn't thank me and ran off with her head bowed. Uh huh. 
Okay, that was a thank you. I thought she was going off to be with her friends, but on the way home, the girl got off the bus and gave me something. It was a short letter and a piece of clover. The letter said, Mr. Andrew, I'm sorry I didn't find you a four-leaf clover written in tiny letters. That was her way of saving, saying thank you. Whenever I pass by the harbor where the school was, I recall the sweet voices of children calling to me Mr. Andrew. Oh, touching story. Hey! Technically that room's not there. That's uh, just a blank wall, unless you use one of the bonus cards to put it there. Alright, empty, 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 not empty. I know this because of the second game. Hey, Mr. Zero. I was just cleaning this room and I came across a secret disc. It must be around somewhere. If you find it, it's yours. I just picked it up. So, yeah. Thank you. Going down. To I got zero. It's been two months since Mr. Opaza left here. I wonder when I'll be promoted to commander. I don't think there's a more qualified successor. If that weren't possible, I might be an operator instead. Mm, sure, sure. Got anything else you want to say? Busy, busy, busy. I think I work the hardest of everyone here. Zero, when you see everyone, tell them how hard I work. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure you work hard, but not that hard. I can see you carrying around the same box all the time. You haven't put it down or got anything else to put into it. Alright, same routine. Empty, 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 not empty. Ah, Mr. Zero, good to see you. I'm taking a break after patrolling the second floor, so don't think I'm just slacking off. Gotcha. Going down, I'm on the first floor. And there's a card, and you, Mr. Zero. I went to the harbor to get... to go stargazing, and a... The shooting star came down and hit me on the head. Now I have a big bruise. On closer inspection, I realized it was, in fact, E-crystals. And these are those very E-crystals. Every time I look at them, I remember that incident. Let me give these E-crystals to you, Mr. Zero. Sure, thanks. Uh, he's also another E-card bonus. Because he's not there either. Nice to meet you. My name is Para Quiet. Para Quiet. <laughs> oh, it's Mr. Zero. Sorry about that. I have poor vision. But that aside, Miss Ciel's research is just incredible. Incomplete as it is, I think that the miracle of undying cyber elves shows the fruits of her labor. I see. I see. And... Oh. Hey, who are you? Oh, it's you, Zero. I just can't stand work. My job. My job is to watch the harbor all day. All day, every day. Huh? Just kidding. Is that... Haibu heard me say that. He'd sure be mad. Oh, hey. Oh, yeah. I found this disc underneath this load. Do you want it? Sure. Well, you're not expecting to get it for free, are you? Let me think. Alright, you can have it if you answer my question. Do you know that small reploid down the hall? The one that carries a book with him wherever he goes? Answer me this. What's his name? I just talked to him. He said his name was Araquia. So you knew. Very well then. Here, take it. As, a pro as I promised. Cool, got another card. Um, off. 
I ran to talk to you. Hello, Mr. Zero. I'm sure you've forgotten my name. I'm... Adtrush. I don't know if I said that right or not. I've been carrying loads around here for years. Sometimes I wish I could do something else, but there just isn't anything that I'm good at. Sorry, I didn't mean to gripe to you, Mr. Zero. And if I talk to him again, he's just gonna say the same thing, isn't he? Alright, back up to level 4. Ah, no, wrong one. There we go. Hello! Oh, it's you, Zero. Did you get your new weapon from Servo? If not, you should go get it soon. Let me know how it works when you do. I can't really test its potential in the lab. Your recoil rod is strongest when charged. It incorporates features from triple and chain rods. Cool. It will require some effort to master it. I'm sure it will. And it's going to be very useful. Alright. So. Uh... Bray. I modified that with a bonus card. Boot complete. Subject of interest? Uh, neither one of those right now. Oh, hey, Zero. I've been waiting here the whole time for Ciel. She came in and left again right away. This is... this little guy is a bit worn out, so I'd like it fixed. I guess Ciel must be busy. I wonder where my little Kriya and Priya went. They are my precious baby owls. Did you know that I could talk to them a little? At first, it was just me, 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 and other baby babble. Zero, please let me know if you find them. Sure, no problem. I'll keep an eye out. Promise me, okay? Sure, sure. And that's the last card in the base for right now. Hey, Zero, you're alright. I heard the news. Despite the new energy, the world is still not at peace. I never thought peace would be easy, but still. Anyway, I just finished a new weapon for you. I also fixed your chill boomerang. Here, take it. You got the recoil rod. You got the S boomerang. Oh, one more thing about secret discs. Secret discs contain things that you can't decode, right? Well, I can analyze them for you, so stop by any time. And you can also talk to me if you ever want to look at them, at the contents of a disc we've already analyzed. Sure, thank you. Operator, Mr. Zero, please come to the command's, commander's room. The tongue stopped working again. Immediately. Zero, they're asking for you. This recoil rod looks easy to use. Thanks. The world is too much for Ciel to bear alone. Take good care of her, Zero. And to show off one of the, the recoil rods real fast, they're tonflets. And if you charge them up, you can get a really big jump out of them. Let's see, where's the perfect spot to do it? Ah, uh, here. See, I can only go this high in here, but with the uh, recoil rod, we can use it as a springboard. So. Alright. Um, I'll be using that some more than gun, but probably not much, because it has specific uses at, for in certain areas of the game. It 
is very useful. But its attack speed is very lacking, in my opinion. It's not as fast as a sword. Anyway, I think I'll end the video here, and I'll see you guys in the next one when we start up the mission. So until then, see you guys.